Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do a quick review on copycat makeup. So if you're interested, stick around. And if you enjoy the video, don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the bell, you know what to do. Thanks. As you can see, my makeup looks a little crazy. I'm missing a few things. And that is because I bought a few of the copycat products that I had the originals. So I thought it'd be kind of fun to do one half of my face in the uh, originals and the other half of my face in the dupes. So um, just to let you know, what I've got here is I have the Naked Heat palette and I have the dupe for the Naked Heat palette. And I have my Tarte Maneater pencil and I have the dupe for that. And then I also have the Stila eyeshadow and that is in Kitten Karma. Yeah, Kitten Karma. And this is the dupe for it. Okay, well let's go ahead and dive in. Here is the Naked Heat palette and their version. I'm not sure if you can see this. And what I'm going to do is the exact same eye colors on both eyes. And this side I'm going to use the dupes. And on the left side of my face I'm going to go ahead and use the originals. And I'm using different brushes so I don't cross contaminate any of the product. On the Urban Decay, I'm going to just tap into Chaser and just put that all over the eye. Just because I only have primer on and I want to give each of these a nice equal chance. I'm going to dip into En Fuego, which is this deep burgundy color and put that in the corner of my eye and just kind of put that across the crease a little. I'm going to dip into Ashes which is the second to the last color and put that right in the corner and just spread that up a little. And I'm going to tap into the Lumbre and just put a little of that in the middle. And I'm not wetting the brushes. I'm using everything dry. So it gives a, a good comparison. Woo! Look at the fallout on the Urban Decay. Holy cow. Hold on a second. Okay, well that was a tremendous amount of fallout on the Urban Decay side. I've not really had that problem, but I haven't used this color very often. I don't know if it's because it's a shimmer or why that just happened, but moving right along. And I'm going to stop there because I'm going to use the Stila on the inner corner. That will do it with the Urban Decay colors. Now I'm going to use the Copycat palette and I'm going to take a very similar brush and once again I'm going to use the same colors. I'm going to dip into this very light neutral color just to put all over my eye. Blend this out just to cover all of my primer, my eye primer. And then I'm going to dip into this third color and put that in the corner. Oh, seems pretty pigmented. I do see a little fallout, but nothing, definitely not any more than the Urban Decay had. I'm gonna dip just a little bit more and push this through. I have to say, as far as the pigments go, I'm, I'm very happy. It seems pretty much the same. And I'm going to dip into the second to the darkest color and just put that in the very corner and blend that over a little bit. Wow, I would almost say it's darker. Hmm. And then I'm going to go in with that shimmery color that was the same as the Urban Decay that had all the fallout. And this is doing the same thing. I'm going to put that right in the middle. I feel that 
the copycat color is a little bit more intense. Okay, well I'd say they're about even now. Now I'm going to go ahead and challenge the Stila with the Copycat Beauty. And this is Kitten Karma, so I'm going to use the Stila on the left eye. Okay, so that's the Stila. And now I'm going to use the Copycat on my right eye. Wow. I have to say, I am very impressed. I don't know if you guys can tell a difference, but in real life, I cannot tell a difference at all. Okay, well, we're two for two. And the last product that I have is the Man Eater Eyeliner and the copycat version of the Man Eater Eyeliner. So I'm going to do my left eye once again with the name brand. And now I'm going to open the Man Eater version of the copycat makeup, if I can get it open. Okay. Okay. I'm going to take a quick look at the pencil tips to show you the difference. Very similar. Okay, and let's see how the copycat does. I have to say the feeling of the product and the appearance seem very similar. Okay, well, what do you guys think? Do you think that the Urban Decay or the Copycat Beauty? I think they're both very comparable. As a matter of fact, I think this one laid down a little bit better, but that could just be my imagination and being hopeful that an $8.99 product is just as good as the $40 some dollar, $48 I think is what I paid for the Naked Heat a couple months ago because my first one expired. And what do we think about the Stila versus the Copycat? I would say they're very similar. Similar color, similar shimmer amount, same amount of glitter. I don't think that one is better than the other on this either. And as far as the Maneater and the Copycat Eyeliner of Maneater, I like it. I like it too. I think they're both really comparable. So for my three products, I would definitely buy the Copycat again. I'm really uh, happy with it. So if you guys see something I don't, because I'm not wearing my glasses right now, by all means, let me know. And if you've tried Copycat or thinking about it, leave your comments below. I'd love to hear your experience because I'm thinking I'm going to try a few more of these now that I kind of got my feet wet and I feel like these first three products are amazing. I think I'm going to try some more. So at any rate, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.